Good morning, this is David Lynn, your Prepper Principal, and this is me trying to put together a goodie box for a young man from Oklahoma who is a subscriber and a good uh, friend, Joseph Moore. Joseph <clears throat> has reached out to me. We've talked. <clears throat> he uh, He's getting involved with prepping. Uh, country boy, to my knowledge. He uh, married with children. Very nice young man. And uh, he does not produce content. He may start producing content at some point in time in the future. I'm sure he will grow a very nice channel if he chooses to do so. In the meantime, I am blessed to have him support me and mine. So this is me putting together a goodie box for uh, Joseph Moore. And I'm, I'm trying to get some stuff done this weekend. My wife and my daughter are out at Caleo Creek Park camping. Let me go close that door. I think that door is probably producing some light that I don't necessarily want. One of my dogs is inside. One of my dogs is outside. My dog Maya is sitting underneath the table with me. I think that's better. Okay, <clears throat> so we start out with the box, and I need to put the box together. This morning went to Ramsey's restaurant, nice restaurant. I uh, invited one of my teacher assistants and her husband, very nice people, to have breakfast with me. And one of my former teachers, when I was his principal, I was over career education in Victoria before I left. Spent my last few years outside the district working in a little place called Yorktown. It's a high school principal there. What in the world? Uh, got little white stuff on my pants. You send a box, you tape it real good because you never know what's going to happen in transit. Sometimes I just pray that the box gets there. I always get tracking for my boxes. So that's the bottom. We have a box. Looks like we have lift off. Well, not quite. I usually do this sitting on my roll top in my man cave, which is our fourth bedroom in the back. Today I'm basically using our dining or kitchen table. I'm drinking coffee from Ramsey's cream in it. Um, this is one of my Blue Eddies. It's an EP3, uh, small little Blue Eddie, about a 300 watt system. Very nice, very nice. It's good for small applications. I'm using it to power my ring light right now. So I got it sitting right here. Move it a little bit out of the way. And you go normally and you go on like the Amazon or you go and you want to buy one of these. They're normally about three hundred dollars plus tax time license. I get them when they're on sale for like one ninety nine. So I have two of these. One I took this one out of my daughter's room and the other one my wife has and uh, later today I'm gonna do an unboxing of an EB70, which is a larger uh, one of these from Blue Eddy. It's a very nice one. So we're going to get some um, <coughs> we're gonna get some bubble for this. I don't want to. I want to protect what I'm sending. So I'm getting some bubble wrap.
put this in. I'm going to protect the contents. Y'all have to tell me if you like the close up or if you like the more distant version when I do these. So, the first thing I'm adding, and I had an image which I'll put in of what's in all, all the little components together. First thing I put at the bottom of it is a Coggins folding camp stove. Right now they're going for about $12. Uh, I think I paid for two of these, like $26, about $13 actually, with taxes and everything. It was about $13. Um, I put one of these in. Very nice. Good for uh, boiling water, making a little fire. Okay, put you in here. <laughs> Come on now. All right. Then, after I get that in, I've got a couple of cans of Sterno. This is going to go in it. This goes for about, I think I got these for about $6.50 plus tax. Probably about $7.50 for two of them. Each one of these cans burns for a couple hours. You can start it, stop it, relight it, put it out. Safe to use inside, outside. Doesn't have a bad smell to it. You can actually use it to, to heat a small bedroom in an emergency if the power is out or if the don't have heating. A couple of these burning will keep room above freezing. In an emergency SHTF, certainly, you want to buy some more of these, uh, Joseph. Get you started with what I'm sending you. So I put that in there. And then, likewise, another application. This is an emergency stove, Kogan's emergency stove. I'll open it up and show you what's in it. Uh, it's the stove, and it'll have... Um, 24 tabs with it, fuel tabs. You burn a couple of these on it while you're heating your water, whatever, reheating something. You put a pot, you know, or a cup. If you want to, you can angle it for just a cup, a mug. This goes for about 12 bucks. Delivered. I'll put one of these in there. I've also put an extra 24 fuel tabs. Putting a pack of uh, windproof, waterproof matches. I got these. These are going for about five fifty now. If you buy one, I got these for two fifty on clearance. I bought a bunch of them. When you can find stuff on clearance, buy it. Put that in. And then uh, I like to send people my version of hot sauce. This is a Tabasco 5 ounce. It is a the regular classic sauce. Uh, it goes for about $3.56 over at uh, Walmart right now. Put one of these in. And uh, this is the uh, Tabasco Chipotle sauce. This is a uh, two on the heat scale. Very tasty, a five ounce. Again, $3.56, nice. Put that in. And uh, this is a Tabasco Jalapeno, the green sauce. It is a one on the heat scale from one to five. It's very tasty. Uh, you like jalapeno taste, but not super hot. This is good. Put that in.
and a few versions of my coffee that I like. Uh, <clears throat> this is a Taster's Choice six, six pack of House Blend. It's a light to medium. Uh, $1.16 for a six pack of these little sachets, little packets. Put one of those in there. And uh, this is a Folgers Classic Roast, seven sticks for a dollar. Nice, nice. And uh, this is a Nest Calf. Classico. It is a dark roast, seven packets. I get these, I order these on Amazon, and I get like a, a 12 of these for, oh, $12.88, tax title license delivered. 12 of these for, and you get um, 84. So, put some more of this in there. Trying to protect the stuff. And we'll seal up the box. So this will wind up, when I put it together, this will wind up being a um, premier, probably, I'll probably premiere this is coming um, Wednesday, 6.30 p.m. This will go to Joseph, get it mailed out to him. Takes about three days before he gets it. My friend Joseph Moore. I'll put a link to his channel if you want to uh, subscribe him. Again, he's not a content creator, but hopefully he will be at some point, and I'm sure he'll do a great job. A family man, uh, good, good old school. Um, so everybody, thank you for watching this. This is me trying to get back and trying to support those who support me. Everybody, remember the scout motto is be prepared. These are trying times. Um, you need to have food, drinking water, anticipate something happening. You're along the coast, there are hurricanes, tornadoes. Uh, winter time, you have these freezes. Sometimes you can have a hard freeze, the power goes out for a while, you need to be prepared. Life is good, but it is what it is. Drink coffee. Good stuff. Everybody, have a, a blessed day. And we'll see you for another edition of Coffee Talk. Bye.